What's good, best gang? Today's video, I'll be showing you how to make your homemade crappie jig. What you need is some glue. I recommend epoxy. Some thread. A jig head. Something to cut your line with. And anything to be the tail of your bait. You can use bucktails for garland. So you want to mix Let's up your started. epoxy or glue. Mix it up real good. I'm using epoxy so I'll have to mix up two things. Put it on your mixer and just smear on the jig head because this will help hold in that thread in place and it will not slip off easily. It's five minute epoxy so it'll dry in five minutes and will hold the thread on pretty well. Take about a foot the 30 foot of thread and just wrap it around the jig head keep wrapping it until you have it until you have the full body of it you can wrap it onto the hook if you want to kind of like I did but you want to get the full body of it um, make it have a big um, really big presentation and just wrap it around it and keep wrapping until you have how you like it you can have a full body or you can just wrap it a little it does not really matter so once you've got it done you want to secure it in place with the epoxy and this is going to be where you're going to be sticking your feathers or anything back on to make the tail of your bait with it so just stick it on and wrap it around just a little if you need to just like this and when you're done just wrap your feather bucktail for in place and this will hold your feathers or anything that you have as a tail in place and it will not get ripped off that easily After it's done, this is what it should look like. I chose a white bucktail feather with a white chicken feather with yellow yarn on the back. So hit the like button and subscribe.